Hello, I am Ginko Sequoia. I am the author of the book The Tree Mystic. Today I'm going to read out a small extract on careers. It's with Bruno, one of the volunteers, and Solly the Tree Mystic. They're digging in the fields when Bruno puts his spade down. Solly, how do you think I should approach a new beginning if I want to start a new career or life? Think of what makes your senses come alive. If you were a flower, what might open your boats? If you were a salmon, what might make you swim upstream? You must understand that within us, like plants and animals, we have passions buried within us. Let me explain career paths further. I have seen five types of people. The first are those that don't know what they want and they haven't inquired as to what their purpose is. These people usually end up in jobs that they do not like, if in fact they have a job at all. The second are those that choose a career related to what they are good at instead of what they are passionate about. Often their careers eventually bore them. The third are influenced by parents. If their parents are pushy, they might be bullied into material success, canned like sardines into professional careers that bring riches without happiness. Or their potential might remain unfulfilled because their guardians or parents gave them no encouragement or perhaps didn't want them to succeed. Then they lack self-belief and often settle for mediocrity. The fourth are those that search for their passion and then pursue a career in this field. Let us assume that you chose this fourth option. You might pursue your passion and create your own vision and your own business project. You may think all will be well. However, what was once your friend can easily become your jailer. Before long, you can find yourself being enslaved by a passion that consumes you, steals your freedom and sucks your friends and your family away in the process. Fortunately, there is a fifth way. Here, you make your skills available to something higher than yourself. You make the decision to connect to the universe, to make a difference and acquire meaning in your life. With the fifth way, it does not matter if you use your skills that you are passionate about or the things that you are good at but not passionate about. This is because you will soon feel differently about them. What do I do then? Wait for your mission to arrive. Here you will find purpose and a reason for living. What will that be? I have no idea. I can only recommend that you resist creating your own vision. However, if you make your passion and your skills available to a higher source, everything will change. Any enslaving will stop. Everything that was taught will loosen. Sully lifted his spade and pointed it at the sky. Then if you want to check if your calling is true, wait until the harvest moon is out. As it bathes the wheat fields in its luminous milky light, so it will illuminate you. You can buy the Tree Mystic on Amazon or thetreemystic.com. That's all for now. Thank you.